Hello, my name is Nusrat Fatima. Uh, this is Group 7 and this is the project uh, demonstration for Group 7 and our topic is Spark Graphics. Um, uh, this project has two parts, uh, part one and part two. First, pro uh, first part is, uh, is to execute a simple graphics operations and part two is uh, to, create, to execute Dijkstra's shortest path algorithm for a given set. So for the part one, we need to create a Scala Spark project and add dependencies in Scala ID. Uh, to do that, we need to create a Maven project in Scala ID. I have already done, I have already created the Maven project. To do that, we need to add dependencies from those, in, we need to add dependencies from the instructions. These are the dependencies. Uh, have added to the form form .xml file and also uh, and also you need to uh, you need to download download the file from this link and add it to the and add it to the project like this so here we have added it we have added to that file to this project and then we need to execute it. So for doing that, we need to first run run this project uh, as a clean. First, we need to clean it, and then we need to run run it as Maven install. So uh, we have we have run it successfully, and we we get uh, so we we create a target file, and then uh, this and then the jar file is created in that target file. So we have created a jar file. To run this jar file, uh, we need to start a EMR cluster. I have already started the EMR cluster and uh, create a bucket in the s3 bucket so this is my this is the bucket and uh, uh, i have you need to upload the dot jar file this is the dot jar file which uh, which we have uploaded and then we need to run this we need to run the jar file using this command so to run this command, we need to we need to connect the to the master node using putty. So I have connected it to the putty and execute the this command. So here I'm giving this part as a output file name so the execution is done this will give us this will give us seven files seven output files each containing a, a, a file so I have already downloaded it. So this is the part. This is the part one output in each uh, in each file. In each file it has a different So this is the output for the part one. Now coming to the part two. So for this, we have we are we are going to execute a Dijkstra's shortest path algorithm for a given data set. Mm, what does this uh, Dijkstra's shortest path algorithm the algorithm does is it it is used to find shortest path between two nodes in a given graph. 
So for that, we need to first create a new Maven project, which is similar to the part one, where it uh, it where it generates a dot jar file. For that, we need a scalar scalar file, uh, and this is go, uh, this file can be downloaded from this link, and we have all added it to the new Maven project, and then. Uh, it is similar as a part one. We we run it as a we run we run this program and we we'll, we get a jar file, and this jar file is is uploaded to the S three bucket. So this is the part two jar file. Along with the jar file, we are we are we have to upload two text files. One is a terms text file, and other is a animal distances text file. So the terms text file contains graph vertices and uh, the distances text file contain graph edges in the format, in this format. So in this format, the graph edges are present, present in this file. So these three files are uploaded to S3 management, uh, S3 uh, bucket. To run this jar file, we need to we need to use this command. So I have this command here. So I'm going to run this command. As this is a very big file, it takes uh, time to execute the command. So I have already have uh, files. So these are the output files for the part two. So So we are able to find shortest path with respect to the input uh, input files given. So these are the fi files we get from the part two. These are the output files. So we have uh, so we have done with part one and part two. And after you are done uh, using EMR cluster you need to terminate the cluster by clicking on this terminate button and this terminate uh, as my program is running i'm not going to terminate it uh, and also you need uh, and also you are going to delete the s3 bucket so so that you are not going to charge uh, delete this as uh, as soon as you are you are done with the project so this is the demo for the for this group project thank you